Wing Commander Cyril Withers was the principal scientific officer for the Ministry of Defence at RAF Boscombe in Wiltshire when, in 1952, he witnessed something which made an indelible impression upon him. His job involved the secret testing of equipment aboard a Canberra PR-9. This was uh, a very special flight in that uh, we'd been asked to test a Canberra aircraft at as high an altitude as possible and find out exactly how high the aircraft would go. We managed to get up to, to, to 55,000 feet, mainly at that stage to test the radar unit. Just about as we were to call it a day, we suddenly got a signal on the radar. This we discovered was about uh, eight miles away from us and shining very, very brightly. Now this could have been uh, entirely sun reflection or it could have been self-generated brilliance. We still wanted to confirm that it was not any sort of false indication and we could actually see in the distance something glistening it was about 30 to 40 feet diameter with a central dome we were quite determined to uh, report this to the ground station when we got down in view of the fact that uh, no other aircraft at that time could fly or be flying from any country at that altitude. To say what speed it was going at, I would uh, be very difficult to say, but it certainly be well in excess of 200 knots, well in excess of that. I would think possibly more like 500, because it vanished so quickly. I'm still convinced that this was some reconnaissance object from another planet and that uh, uh, I wouldn't like to guess. I, 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 I would think that it, it was uh, certainly generated by something quite different to anything we know of. 